What's up everybody? This is Jimmy and Jeff once again at Mod Tone. Today we're showing you the Mod Tone Vintage Wah, which is uh, based on the 60s Wahs that we all know and love. It's a, uh, a fantastic pedal that's built for the road, uh, all metal construction, and we've updated a few things just to make it uh, a little more user friendly. As all Mod Tone pedals are, this one comes with a five-year warranty. It's a true bypass pedal, uh, quality input jacks, quality output jacks, and uh, it's just a really cool pedal. So let's uh, let's hear what it sounds like. First off, I'm starting with a Les Paul Custom into a Vox AC15, and here's what this sounds like. <laughs> So there you go, there's that. The real cool thing that I personally like about this wah pedal is, simple as it sounds, but it's the on-off light. Because lots of times you hit your wah pedal, don't know it's on, and you spend the rest of the night wondering what's wrong with your tone, and then come to find out your wah pedal's been on the whole time. Not that I've ever done that. But anyway, it's real cool, if you can see there, I kicked it on, the red light says, you're on. So there you go wide range of, uh, of, of tones here and I'll give you a sort of an idea of what this sounds like. You've all heard this common thing. So you can get real funky with it. It Tell sounds me. awesome, Jimmy. It, it does. Hey, uh, something else that you, you need to know about the Mod Tone Vintage Wah. Um, a lot of stock wahs you get out in the, in the stores today um, you buy them and then you instantly have to take it to their local pedal guru um, to get him to mod it for some cool stuff. Um, True Bypass is the first thing, like you mentioned before, ours comes straight out of the box, already ready to go. Um, and another thing we did straight out of the box is we added um, a an upgraded inductor. This is what gives a wah its sound. Um, we went from a stock inductor to a halo inductor, um, which gives it that classic vintage vibe. Just We did a couple things to make sure that our wah was a better value for the money and, and could give you a greater sound. And it's got an adjustable treadle. What's that? It does. It comes with what looks like a truss rod wrench inside. Um, and what it does is, in the back here, um, there is a little hex nut that lets you adjust how hard it is to sweep forward and sweep back. So if you want it to be a little easier, you loosen that nut. Uh, if you want it to be harder to move, you can tighten it. So it's like a like you can adjust the feel of the pedal. Absolutely, it becomes custom to what you like it to be. Hmm. Because hmm. some guys like it a little looser and a little easier, and some don't. Absolutely. That's cool. That's cool. Um, another thing people don't commonly consider on a wah pedal uh, that ours is great at because of the wide sweep and EQ spectrum that it'll go. A lot of people do stock licks, which we've all heard, and they're great stuff like this. We've all heard that. But consider this for a second. That's actually a floor tone shaper. It's kind of like an auxiliary tone pot. So you can shape your solos or your lead lines or even your chords and make them jump out just by barely moving the sweep of that pedal. You can get all kinds of cool in-between tones like this. Hear me sweeping it? That will cut through the mix in a live situation, a recording situation, or whatever. So it's the Mod Tone. Vintage Wah, built to last. Get one. See ya.